Alright, so if you've been on YouTube for the past year or so, you probably heard the name Nikocado Avocado floating around as he's become a staple in the YouTube meme section because of the way he acts in his videos. If you're not too familiar, Nikocado Avocado started his YouTube channel by doing vegan mukbangs and talking about the benefits of becoming a vegan. In this moment of time, he stated that he was around 150 to 160 pounds, but as he continued gaining more and more views, Nick would start to up the amount of food eaten in one video to unsafe levels. <laughs> He would start to eat thousands of calories of junk food just to get some views and it wasn't long after when he became obese and started implementing this weird character in his videos. After the entire world population roasted Nick for choosing to ruin his life for some views while acting in a weird way, he finally decided to change for the better and in a recent video uploaded to his third channel named How Much I Weigh Now Pizza Mukbang, he talked about how he started to lose weight. In the hour long video, he answered questions his fans had about him and near the end he talked about how he started exercising and going on walks which has made him feel better as a person I lost 89 pounds you guys 89 pounds that's not from sitting still that's from exercising it's going from walks that's going to the parks so him going from this <laughs> To looking like this and actually acting like a normal person is amazing to see. To put it into perspective, the last time he was behaving normally and showing signs of happiness was when LeBron Drew Rosen became popular for this meme. Yeah! He is talking about his weight loss journey in a pizza mukbang or mukbang or cockbang whatever but after losing 90 pounds I think it's totally fine like fuck it add some ice cream on that pizza and stick it up your ass. For the past year, Nick has been posting a video almost every day across his 6 channels and eating 5000 plus calories of straight up junk food has really destroyed his life. I mean who posts a TikTok doing this? Papa John's pizza! But he's recently slowed down his content quantity which is probably because he's been exercising and trying to lose weight. He's also known for crying on camera because his life isn't going well but people began realizing in this weight loss video Nick was actually making jokes, laughing, having a good time and not acting in this weird way he usually acts. Not putting on a character in this video shows more of a serious and normal side of him which makes me think he may be taking this weight loss journey seriously instead of doing it for views like he always does. This actually could be one of the the greatest comeback stories on all of YouTube. I mean just comparing how he looks from this video to a random photo you can see the amazing transformation he's done over the last few months. Like in the left photo he looks like an average American and in the right photo he looks like an 8000 pound rhino that just ate 500 watermelons. Nick has always been known as the YouTuber that's killing himself for views which isn't really a title anyone would want but now is the perfect chance to switch boats and rebrand his channel to be known as the YouTuber that changed his life for the better against all odds. Okay, hold the fucking double cheeseburger deluxe. I just went on TikTok and found out after 5 days he posted the weight loss video, he started gaining weight again. Like look at this TikTok. And then he posted another TikTok one day after and wrote I don't care anymore. After all the comments supporting Nick's weight loss, he decided it was too much for him and in 5 days he apparently gained 30 pounds and is back to 353 pounds. You can see the comments under these TikToks being split into two sections with some still trying to support him and others back to roasting him and how sad this is. Hopefully these are just old videos and he's still on the weight loss journey but if not, Fuck you. Comment down below what you think about this situation and feel free to like and subscribe if you enjoyed.